Hello guys, in this video tutorial I will continue to explain you how to create the model for beginners in FreeCAD. So let's open the FreeCAD and open the image workbench. And after that let's create the document and let's import our, our image with 2D draft of detail from path. So I will find it here it is jpeg file let's import it it to the view and let's import the image file to 3d view let's choose this jpeg file and you can see it here in 3d view and in this 2d view we will be using the 3d view for choosing the dimensions of this detail and let's activate the part design workbench and here Let's create the body and this body will be contain our sketches and different uh, tools of results creation of this detail. Let's close the sketch and let's transform positions of this JPEG file because it's not convenient to see our image in sketch and let's translate it some else in x and y axis and activate the sketcher so i think it's enough so let's create this uh, side of the body it will be 2d sketch of this part of detail let's choose the line tool and set our first line and set the vertical line and horizontal line and le let's set the dimensions for this line it will be 90 millimeters and so for vertical line it will be 50 millimeters let's choose it here let's set the vertical and set the dimension and now we have the green full connected sketch it mean we cannot to change the dimensions for our uh, part of sketch and let's create another lines here it will be full closed sketch and let's set the dimensions for these lines You can choose this tool, it uh, will ch set the dimensions for um, line in any position, it uh, will change only length. And so now uh, we have to set this, it means it will be 40 millimeters and mean the bottom part will be 10 millimeters. Yes. Let's check it and um, let's create this circle here. Let's set the center and let's set the position of center using the dimensions constraints. Yes, it will be vertical and horizontal dimension. Let's set vertical and set 40 millimeters and horizontal dimensions F is choosing two points yes let's set 12 and now the last dimension will be the diameter of this circle you can choose it here change uh, to diameter we can change uh, set the radius of course and the chamfer we will create in the model I think so let's make the extrude operation for our 2d sketch and we'll create 3d model let's set some number body and 
let's set the real dimension it will be 50 millimeters so uh, this part we have to create the chamfer for these two edges and so now let's make the chamfer for two another edges and uh, we have created the our chamfer for our model and now let's create this cut of block this cut on the surface let's choose the surface this upside of model and create the sketch on this upside so let's create the rectangle and for this rectangle let's set the dimensions okay let's set the 20 let's choose this line and set the dimension let's try this uh, it is not what we need and let's choose this let's set the 20 millimeters and we have to make the rectangle symmetry to x axis so let's 10 set 10 millimeters for between x axis and our rectangle side and let's close the sketcher and create the cut it will be 50 minus 15 millimeters and minus 10 it will be 25 millimeters let's set it here and now let's create the triangle part of model let's uh, choose the sketcher and create it in XY plan and click OK and on XY plan let's import to the sketch the external edges for from 3D model it will be this line and this line and we will connect our lines to this external edges so let's set two lines and set the dimensions for this line let's choose this line and set the vertical line the line, line dimensions set it but we have the false because uh, we have we can have to delete this constraint from 3d model and uh, from sketch and let's set 15 millimeters length of the line and for this length of triangle will be 35 millimeters yes and let's connect our two points and create the rectangle sketch okay it is fully connected sketch let's close it and create the extrusion let's set the dimensions and we have to make the symmetry to plan activate it and create this part let's make the refine true and now we have to create the last hole for our model let's create the circle and we have to set it some position center of this circle will be from this part let's <coughs> set this dimension let's import to 
to the sketch the external edge let's choose it here and set the position of circle center from two these points let's set the radius or diameter it will be 20 millimeters diameter and let's close it and create the cut operation for our hole let's set 10 its thickness of our plate and click OK and we have finished creation of our model let's delete the image thank you for watching subscribe to the channel goodbye